Akira Toriyama's manga theater. And oh boy, there's a reason why I was holding that this at the very end because uh, while I did start already reading it, uh, at least I'm a um, I'm reading about like the Wonder Island. Apparently there's Wonder Island too, and it got me to thinking that I really would love to review each of the stories. Uh, but if, if it's like a two-parter, then I'm like, yeah, I want to do reviews of this when it comes to Akira Toriyama's way previous work before Dragon Ball. Hey everyone, Jigs VL here with a brand new, uh, somewhat Dragon Ball type of topic. I say that because this is actually going to be a, you know, a pre-Dragon Ball discussion and review when it comes to Akira Toriyama's uh, earlier works before Dragon Ball came to fruition. That is right. Um, I am talking about the manga theater uh, that has been put out, and luckily I read um, a first two chapters that is known as wonder island and and oh boy i do want to talk about this one because i thought it was very interesting to read and um i won't deny this though and i can see why this editor and or publisher uh really had to be very blunt towards uh akura toriyama saying that like it was very unpopular so I think the reason being is because like uh, it was not that much eye-catching and especially that like I think it just comes up as a little bit too random and like there is some sort of plot though I mean like there really is when it comes to Wonder Island and Wonder Island 2 uh, I think the issue I see is that like okay so we got this bird-like man like he has like a beak for a mouth like literally speaking uh but like it's not really like a beak like it's like literally his lips and he wants to fly away from the island instead of like any other sensible human being he um uh, you know like built a you know a boat but no like this guy is so stubborn he wants to fly away from this because like he crash landed and he uh, uh and he flew and he flew you know like he he was a pilot of some sort and then you get like um, uh, two um, uh, characters that pop in. One is kind of like, he's kind of like Elvis in a certain extent. And the other one is kind of like a, uh, like, uh, like a fairy or a pixie, whatever you want to call that, um, uh, um, uh, that chick, okay? But yeah, um, uh, she's really tiny and this Elvis-like person, uh, like, um, uh, they're, we're, they're like, they're trying to understand on why he is so uh like very invested and interested in flying uh, and again like rather than like building a boat and like you actually see some back and forth dialogue here and try to be very comedic and i do I actually do get like a few chuckles um here and there uh one of the few uh, uh that i do want to point out is when like uh it is the bird guy is being like uh, okay prepare okay don't be surprised when i tell you this and uh, when by saying that in that context, um, uh, like uh, the person, uh, like the two people, uh, mainly the Elvis guy, uh, looking guy, <laughs> is that like, oh, okay then. Uh, and the, the bird dude, he, he's just so like, really? You're not really that amazed? Like, uh, and then, and then Elvis is all like, well, you told me not to be surprised or wowed or anything like that. Don't. Don't let people like me I'm a dictate I'm a, on how you feel. Uh, like, be real with your emotions. Be honest with yourself. Alright, dude. Wow! <laughs> like, I thought that was kind of funny. Uh, to me, I thought that was pretty damn funny. I'm a win looking and reading that. Um, and I'm not kidding. Uh, and then, when it comes to Wonder Island 2, though, is that um let me see though most of it had nothing to do with what was going on in the first one uh, other than seeing the elvis guy reappearing at the very end though and apparently this one is more like a four wall 
icebreaker and also like um uh, uh, letting you know like hey uh if you guys are into like ultraman and kaiju uh stuff uh you're gonna you're gonna love this by using like police officers <laughs> so when reading that i i, I was like mm, i think i like the first one a tiny bit better because like this one doesn't have too much going on uh if that makes any sense uh but yeah like i said the the elvis guy he just appears at the very end apparently he was inside of an egg <laughs> you know uh but uh i do need to mention this uh, at the end of the first wonder island though is that like uh we see that the bird like uh dude uh literally becomes a chicken <laughs> uh because uh he, uh they he finds out uh that like there's like a wizard or a witch um uh, that can grant uh grant your wish uh, or some sort of power and uh he got what he wanted but not entirely and he was chasing after the elvis looking guy <laughs> he really was so uh, uh as far as i know it like uh, like these the um, uh, storytellings were uh, they're not inherently bad but i wouldn't say they were that really good either though it's kind of like in between though so like i said you get like a few chuckles here and there uh again it's a little bit random but uh, again there's at least a, a beginning and end and some regard in some extent again if that makes any sense but i thought what was really nice uh, is that like you do get to see Akira Toriyama's um, uh, writing process uh, in some uh, extent. Uh, I, I know I keep on using that word a, a lot, guys, but uh, you see these panels and that like in his like um, uh, Toriyama robot, like his Toribot uh, avatar, um, uh, trying to figure out um, on what to do. And apparently, after those those two um, uh, chapters, uh, apparently he came up with the likes of O'Reilly, which is Dr. Slump, right? And Dr. Slump, O'Reilly did appear in the likes of Dragon Ball, which I do need to mention that. So I thought that was very interesting um, uh, when it comes to like, um, uh, during all of that, he came up with the idea of O'Reilly for Dr. Slump, uh, but also something else, something to do with tomatoes or whatnot, but it's a, a, it's a chick. So I'm hoping to review that uh, next. So I, I apologize for stuttering and keep on repeating stuff a lot and rambling, but I really wanted to talk about it and I am very excited in reading more into this. So this, this has been Jigs BL signing off right now. Later.